Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about how to multiply in the sixth power. Now, the sixth power is a pretty uh, high exponent in that the larger the base that you have, the larger the number becomes if you're talking about the sixth power. But when you're multiplying in the sixth power, that means you're multiplying some, a number by itself six times. So, for example, if you have 3 to the sixth power, that means you're taking the number 3 and you're multiplying it by itself six times. So what this means here is you have 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 times 3. So there's going to be six of those. Now, some people think that's 18, but you know that's not really true because the number does grow pretty quickly. Now, when you multiply by the sixth power, one approach would be if you were to break it off into pairs, like so. 3 times 3, 3 times 3, 3 times 3. So as a result, you have 3 times 3, which is going to give you 9 times 3 times 3, another 9, and then 3 times 3, which is another 9. So when you have to the 6th power, you can break it up into uh, 3 pairs, if you will. So, and then you just multiply 2 numbers at a time. 9 times 9 is going to give you 81, times 9 is going to give you 729. So what that means here is 3 to the 6th power is going to give you 729. So if you multiply by the sixth power, you are basically breaking it up into three pairs, and the larger the base, the larger the number, so you just got to allow some time, depending on the situation. So, I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's an illustration on how to multiply in the sixth power.